Hey, 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 what's up, guys? Yeah, let me turn this on. There we go. Sorry for the late start, guys. I'm still over here trying to figure this out. All of a sudden, my uh, computer just decided to uh, not want to have game sound. Can you guys hear me good? Yeah, I've been uh, trying to wrestle with this. I, I don't know what the hell is going on here. I've literally, I'm, I'm, ugh, ugh. So you guys can hear me, right? But you can't hear any game sound, right? There's no audio in the background. Can you guys hear the Zomboid game? No game music. All right. Now the problem is. All right. We're going to. I figured instead of beating my head against the wall, I would invite you guys with me to beat your heads with me against the same wall. Let me completely close this program. Bring up our sound capture. As soon as I turn this on. Boom. I have I no longer have game sound, but you guys don't either, right? It's so annoying when shit like this happens because it's like I've been I've been streaming for fucking ever doing the same shit and uh I never have any issues. So you know what I might actually do guys? Just because I don't want to I don't I don't want to deal with it tonight. Um hold on a sec. Yeah, I think I'm just going to, I'm, I'm going to try to mess around with it tomorrow and figure it out. But what I think I'm going to do is just go back to one PC setup. Hold on a sec. So you guys are going to get a quick swirl. Hold on a sec. All right, uh, can you guys hear me? Yeah, yeah, I'm and then let me write. Oh, oh.
All right, so you guys can hear me, right? All right, well, let's see. I gotta turn the game quick. All right, all right. Now you guys should definitely have game. You should definitely have game sound. Give me two more seconds, guys, since I haven't streamed on one computer in a very long time. It's got to change a couple settings. All right, so now my green screen is. There we go. It's good enough. All right, cool, cool, cool. So we got the game, we got the freaking everything. We'll roll with it. I had you guys waiting long enough. I'll figure this shit out tomorrow. All right, so boom, I got check got this. All right, let's let's get into this. So yes, we are continuing our playthrough with Darla. Um, so what do you guys think I should do to get ready for the winter time? Um, do I not have a? I feel like I might have enough like food and stuff, but then I might be underestimating how long the winter is and how much food I actually have. So we're gonna take inventory of what we got for food. And uh, like I said, this this episode, I wanna focus on getting some traps set um, so we can start doing some trapping. Also, guys, let me know if the stream quality is weird. All right, so um, before we, let's see, we're tired, we're hungry, bored, whatever. Um, I had Darla standing there while I was doing my sound checks, so she was... So first of all, let's uh, smoke really quick. All right, and now uh, this is what I have for food. So I got this filled with just canned foods. Um, we got some MREs. I did want to try to head up to Fort Redstone and um, See if maybe we can find like a pallet of MREs. Because I feel like if we get our hands on a pallet of MREs, guys, oh, we're going to be so good. And then I also got this box with a little bit of food in it. Um, Our garden completely failed. The whole thing just failed. Uh, yeah, so we're going to have to redo our garden or whatnot. Oh, look at all that compost we got, though. And we still have more stuff that's going to compost. What percent is it at? It's at 14%. Um, and also for food, I got a little bit of fish, as you guys can see. So is that not, that's, is that not enough for wintertime? All 
Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna take it. It's probably not. Not that I'm really looking at the food that I have. Let's uh go dump these tools. We don't need these tools on us. Plenty of MREs in the prison. <laughs> I forgot we completely blew out that tire on that truck. Let me see. So all of the stuff I'm gonna put into. Actually, no. Some of the stuff can go away. Um, like this. Where's my wagon? Did I leave the wagon at the gas station? Ha! Guys, did I leave the wagon at the gas station? Seriously? That that's super annoying. So I don't see it. All right, whatever. Let's uh, let's empty out our trunk. Um, got tons of stuff we got to go put away. Actually, the hammer stays. That's part of our kit. The katana could stay. The crossbow. I think we have more bolts, so let's just throw that on our back for now. Flashlight. Okay, yep. So all the, the MRE can stay. This is the stuff we want to take out. And the rest of this is just our kit that we're going to throw into this truck. As you guys can see, I found a shoddy. A SPAS 12 gauge. Wait, Anzirk, so... Without a wood stove, I can't I can't heat my house. Um okay, so that that sounds like that's going to be an issue. Yeah, we got bolts. We got more bolts. Awesome. All right, so let's drop this shoddy in here. Oh, that that case is full. Do I have an extra gun case? Yep, right here. All right, so we drop that in there. Um, we're gonna keep a battery for our flashlight in the car at all times. We'll keep two, two will work. Two batteries. Um, let's go drop this food. So our main goal today is food and, um, well, we're gonna set up our hunting stuff too. I need to learn how to jar too. But we need to we need to start growing um food if we're going to start jarring shit. All right, so this is an empty gas can that I do want to make not empty. All right. So we got enough stuff to start a farm for sure. We're going to go out there. We're going to start a proper farm. Um, hopefully we'll get some rain. And that could go ahead and uh, throw the matches in this bottom crate. And our cleaning liquid can go um, under here, right? I think I have some already. Yep. So we got tons of cleaning liquid too. Ah, Jesus Christ, Carol. <laughs> Still gonna have this open just so I could see. GG, Carol. GG. All right, so we're going to throw our extra socks in here. And... 
So this gas can we're gonna make full when we go out and about. And all the rest of this can go inside. Yeah, we did a really good job um, so far. I feel like we've done a really good job gathering resources. We can actually build some more rain collectors too. Now, a question. Does, do you, does the water in your rain collector freeze in the wintertime? Because that, that would be kind of scary. And... So our gun is... Yeah, we're going to throw the crossbow in the back of the trunk for now. Uh, we got... One, two, three... Yeah, those magazines are good enough for now. Grab all of this, throw this in the backpack, and then we're going to transfer all this into the trunk. This is just kind of my kit that I like to have on me no matter where we go, just in case we get stranded or something. And it only takes up like 7, 18 uh, kilos worth of weight. So this truck is pretty much going to just become our scrap truck now. I'm actually going to move it out the way. We're literally just going to tear this thing apart. You know what I am going to do, though? I am going to siphon um, the gas out of it. Yep, with this gas can. It's got a full tank. Uh, I don't know how much this one has. Let me check. We also got... Oh, yeah, we only got a quarter of a tank here. Um, we also got to make sure we go get some tires. Huh? I thought you said. Let me see something. I think I swear I saw a box of... Yeah, we need screws, right? Do I have screws? I have four screws. How many do I need to, um, repair my hood? How do you siphon gas? I will show you right now, Silent. All right. Um. Yeah. So if I want to replace this hood, I need one metal sheet, eight screws. Um, I can actually get some more screws by disassembling the fence. And uh, we actually might do that in the morning when we wake up. So uh, I want to get this car up to up to snuff. Um, but to siphon gas, what you need is you need a gas can, and then you go up to a vehicle with gas, and then you hit right here, uh, siphon gas. But you need to have a uh, gas can on you, or you won't be able to fill it up. And then, boop, we, we filled this can up with gasoline, bring it over, and then we can literally just add gasoline to this vehicle. And we'll do that probably one or two more times. That way I'm not wasting fuel, you know what I mean? Just sitting in this truck for no reason. And uh, actually might I gotta check and see how much fuel we have in our uh, generator. Jonathan, get that good sleep. I actually need to move this chart again. Like, my... Uh my chat and my thing are on two different sides. And it's annoying. There we go. That's where chat you. All right. Now it doesn't feel too bad. Now it feels normal. All right. We're good. Let's see how much gasoline we have now. Or did I end it early? Yeah, I didn't I didn't fill it up completely. 
So, I mean, that's why I love this game, guys. Just the, the depth and, like, the amount of things that you get to do in it. It's just, it's crazy. That's why I wish people for console had the opportunity to play this game. So, generator info. Oh, yeah, we're at max fuel, pretty much. So, what we're going to do is we'll fill up this gas can. Uh, no, we'll leave it empty. We'll leave it empty. We'll just get some fuel out on the road if we need it. All right, let me see here. And then, boom, boom. We're good on that. We're good on that. Fill our water up later. All right, so before we leave, I'm going to patch up that hood with a... Uh, in the morning, once we wake up, we're going to go get some screws from the fence. Yeah, silent. That'd be fuck. That'd be crazy, dude. All right, so what are we going to eat? Um... Let's grab this jar of peaches. Uh, actually, I shouldn't be eating this crap right now. Can you make a stir fry in a saucepan? Let me see. No, you can't. That sucks. We need to find ourselves a frying pan, guys. Definitely need to find ourselves a frying pan. All right, so let's eat a little bit of fresh food. I don't want to... Um, I don't want to dig into my, my other stuff right now. So we're going to put this in a fridge to defrost for the morning. How many slices of bread? We have the... Grab this. Also throw this in the fridge to defrost for the morning. Um, let's cook a fish. Let's have some fish. Grab a small perch. Um, can we fillet it? Okay, can I not fillet it because it's frozen is the question. Let's turn on our oven. We'll throw it in here. We'll see if I can fillet it once it's defrosted. That would be super cool if they won't even let you fillet the fish until it's uh, defrosted. But I don't know. Maybe it's just, maybe I can't fillet it. I could swear that you could fillet them into like fish steaks or whatever, like fish fillets. Right now, I'm not cooking it. I'm only defrosting it. I'm trying to speed defrost. Boom. Turn off. Grab that out. Yeah. Oh, so you cannot fillet the fish when it's frozen, guys. All right. So how many fish fillets? We got two. Well, it was not a bit very big fish. It was not a very big fish. All right. Um. So we're gonna eat. We're gonna make a special meal tonight. I'm. I'm, I'm feeling. I'm feeling. Feeling good, guys. Let's grab uh one of these empty pots. Let's go fill it up with some water. We're gonna eat that good. <laughs> Literally, but Draco's GG, dude. I, oh, I'm having a good night, Draco's. Thank you so much for being a jerk. <laughs> We're going to fill our cooking pot with water. All right, and then we're going to go get some rice. Where are you at, rice? There we are. Add rice. 
Ooh, wait, we could do a fish. No, no, no. Rice. All right, so we added rice. We'll create rice from fish. And then we're also going to add... So we have a fish fillet rice. Add some more fish. Boom. And then what else are we going to add to it? So we got some we got some rice. We got some fish. Um, we could splash a little bit of wine in there. A little white wine. <laughs> and Crystal says I can't cook, right? You know what? Can we can we throw some throw some eggs in there? Crack about two eggs in there. All right. Add some uh, some salt. Add some pepper. You guys cannot tell me that this shit is not something you would. It's good. You know what? Just to top it off. Let me see. What else What else we got in here? What else can we add? Oh, nothing, nothing, nothing. Can we add some spices or is it spiced out? No, we can, add, we can add some more spices. Let's add this beef. Let's add that beef ramen spice in there. Sprinkle it. Give it a little, give it a little more uh, flavor. You know what I mean? And I think I should be good. Oh no. There's no point. I mean, we'll see what they say, though. I, I think they're... Uh... I am a master chef, Casper. What do you mean, dude? I know you see this this meal that I just prepped. All right, so this is done. Boom. Take that out. All right, and let's make... We'll make four bowls. Four bowls of rice. a cool map add-on military take over top oh i gotta look into that drake i have another one i have four something else i forgot what the hell it was called all right so these each give 14 that's not a lot actually That really wasn't a lot. You know what? We'll, we'll just eat all of it. Screw it. Alright, we're full. Like, really, really full. Um, dump our cooking pot. Dump our bowls. Add our spices back into there and our white wine. All right, one more thing so we can get that good sleep because Darla does not like blood. Let's wash all of our clothing. All right, and let's wash ourselves. Boom. So we're all clean. Smoke that cig, and we're heading to bed. Oh, let me turn that light off right now so we're not just wasting generator fuel. All right. Get that good sleep.
So like I said, in the morning, we're going to build ourselves some traps. Got to look in to see what traps we can build. I think we could do um, box traps because I was, I was a hunter. Oh, shit. I don't even have anything. Uh, I think we have chips, though. I think you can bait with chips. Yep. So let's grab a bag of chips. There we go. And all right. Let me grab my hammer. Uh, we'll grab some nails. grab an extra box just in case we shouldn't need it though yeah we still got plenty of water all right so let's see what kind of traps we can create over here all right where is it trapper all right so if I want to make a wooden box trap Oh, I need a saw. Okay. I'm like, why can't I create the trap? We need a saw. Tomatoes work. Yeah, I don't have peanuts, peanut butter. Okay. Yeah, right now I'm I I was gonna I was gonna bait with until I can get some veggies, I'm gonna bait with chips. Uh, cause I, I have peanuts, but I, I only have like a canister of them. Yep, so let's create. Yeah, we'll just create five of them, I guess. Great <laughs> ghost. Reminded me, I forgot the bear traps. You can pick up a dumpster and take it home? GG, dude. All right, so we got five of these traps. We're going to go set these out in the woods. Oh, why did I put them in my bag? And we'll grab our bag of chips that we're going to bake with. You know what? I might grab a couple bags because I don't know how much of each bag it takes to bait. So we'll grab... We'll just bring three, three bags with us. Yeah, three bags of chips should be more than enough. Close my front door so no zombies make. Because we actually had a zombie up here the, uh, earlier, so. Let's grab our, our honey sandwich. That's going to be. Oh, we got three sandwiches, actually. We only need one. That's our breakfast. Alright, so just gotta be a little careful. We got a gun though. Um you know if anybody wants to come and hang out. We also got a bunch of melee weapons on us, so should have nothing to fear. Alright, so let me see, where's a good spot? I don't want to put them all in like the same area this time. Because at first I thought we had to have them like spread out. Uh, like super far away from each other. But no, you just have to have them a certain distance away from your base. Place another one here. Another one here. Yeah, I had my traps so spread out before. I was like freaking trying to walk through the woods and find it was terrible. Oh, I couldn't find them to save my damn life. 
And we'll do another one here. Closer toward the, the edge, so I can kind of... This will be the trap that should, like... Oh, your traps are right here. Should be able to see it. All right, so let's bait them. Add bait chips. Okay. Add bait chips. Chips. See, processed food is even uh, helping us out. We're wasting food that we probably need for winter, <laughs> but to get better food, you know what I mean? So it's like you, chips are really fatty, you know, in this game, and you don't really want to get super duper fat, you know what I mean? So using chips to get meat, I feel is a good trade. I mean, I don't, I, any of you guys, like that's a good trade. Should probably have like a car over here. I'm gonna park right here that we'll use to drive back and forth. Just so I don't have to walk this distance every single time. Ah, uh, let's stop being lazy. We'll walk. No point in making a bunch of noise near the woods and potentially bringing in zombies. All right, so let me grab my shovel. All right, so baiting those traps, we used a whole bag of chips. Like I said, if, it, if, if not, like I said, I'm pretty sure you should probably hit them up and get our money back. To be able to, like, they're still, they're still gonna get, they're still gonna get. Yeah, they're not gonna really care about that. Damn gummy bear lollipops, like, what do you mean? All right, so let's, uh, for now, let's drop that in there. Um, we're just going to go out and do a little basic gardening. I'm going to try to get potatoes going again. So we're going to get potatoes going again. And uh, and we'll do some more carrots and broccoli. All right, so we got carrots, potatoes, broccoli, and we'll do, how many tomatoes, packs of tomato seeds we got? And we'll do tomatoes, why not? Um, We got, I, I and I wanna try to jar some of the stuff, but I don't know if I even have any vinegar, so that's another, we actually need to make a list. We need to make a freaking list of stuff that we need. We need vinegar. I'm gonna I'm gonna make a list after this for when we go out and loot. Alright. There we go. And we'll uh grab our watering can. They were actually overweight. Oh, that garden can's heavy. All right, so so seeds. We'll do do broccoli on this side. Okay. Dig right here. How do we just get rid of this? There we go. Big furrow. Boom. And then we'll remove this. 
move this. Oh, that's why it wouldn't let me. Yeah, I forgot the. Um, I was like, yo, why wouldn't it let me plant here? For some reason, like a couple of my uh, things like went invisible. Like I couldn't see them anymore. It was really, really weird. Remove the grass. Dig a furrow. Alright, and then uh here we'll do potatoes. And then here we'll do. As you guys can tell, I'm not much of a, I'm not much of a farmer, but I'm trying. I'm I'm more of a let's just go out and loot for food, than like a let's grow food. But I see the importance. I definitely see the importance of being able to just grow your own food. And here we'll do carrots. So how many of you guys, you know, just do a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you guys are like fans of gardening. Like if you were, you know, in this, would you also be doing a garden? Or are you more of like a go out and loot for food type of person? Hunt for meat and stuff like that. And then we'll do our tomatoes. Red Valley? Okay. My man Primal, he's not a farmer. So yeah, thumbs up if you are a farmer, thumbs down if you're not a farmer. Instant gratification type of person. Andrew's like, I do it all, man. I, I don't, I, I, I do it all. I loot and I grow food. Full on wilderness survivor. Oh man, the tomatoes are cool. Yeah, so that's what I'm trying to do right now is I'm trying to store all my non-perishables for wintertime. And then I'm going to, you know, try to eat all the fresh foods and stuff like that. I wish we could get some rain. That'd be super nice. Let me see if we have any rain incoming, actually. All right, so let's dump all of our gardening stuff back. So there's a lot of you guys. Yeah, they'll cover all bases that, you know. Oh, and we got some worms for fishing. You know, I like that. Where's my trailer at? I left it over at the base, didn't I? Throw these worms in here. A tent, a pot, and a campfire. My oh, man, Anzer lives off the land, man. Loot, set up, garden, loot. Hey. That's some good stuff, yeah. So that, because I mean, I'm more of a like, like I said, I'm more of a. Alright, so this holds forty. Uh, let me see. We'll give each one. Are all these already watered? Oh, let me ch info. So, how are these already well watered? Is it because the ground was it, it recently rained on? Or what? What the hell's going on here? Why are these well watered? I ain't gonna argue. Info. This one is parched, though. Let's give it some water. We'll go with a 30. I wanna see how far 30 brings it. 
dry. So we'll give it another 10. Man, these things are going to suck up so much water. All right, so we're just going to have to give it a full. Bill. Let me check. Info. Well watered. Yeah, so we're just going to have to give each one a full. See, this is the only downside, guys, is gardening and the water usage. Like, look how much. This is going to wipe out one of my whole rain collectors. Just, I guess it is what it is. Living next to a water source would be super awesome. It's just nerve-wracking. I already emptied this one, and I'm about to empty this one, but I guess it doesn't matter because, like, I'm not really... This whole time, they've just been full and just sitting here. You know what I mean? Like, I haven't really been using them. And I'm pretty sure it's going to rain again. So we just emptied another one. Wait, did I just... Oh, I was like, did I just taint my freaking water? R. Sims, thank you so much, man. I really appreciate that, dude. Uh, let's see. So we gotta. So this ring collector is. That one still has water. That one still has water. I was like, man, did I really uh, empty that already? That's parched. That's water that full. Well watered. Man, this feels like work. <laughs> oh, shit. All right, we ran out of water. Now it's actually out of water, right? No, it's not. That's at zero. That one's not. Yep, we could fill. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're gonna have rain, so that yeah, that's why I'm, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna even stress it. Not even gonna stress it. And plus, I have I have I do have quite a few. Um... Quite a few of these rain collectors. Like I got the five right here, and then I have another five right here, right up against the building. And I could build a couple more if I wanted to, which I might actually do. We're about to empty two of them. How much is left in there? All right, now it's empty, right? Yep, so we fully emptied those two. Boom. All right, uh... I think that is good. The day of gardening. Setting our traps. We'll actually go out and check our traps. I don't know how long it takes to get something, but uh, before, before it's time to go to sleep, we'll, we'll head out there for really quick. Give her a little gander.
yes, there are big tanks of water that you can fill. Um, there's actually trailers that you can fill. Um, right now I have these that I stole from the offices that I have been filling. Um, but yeah, to go out, uh, I need to find one of them uh, water trailers. That would be super nice. That way I would probably have to fill that maybe once every couple weeks. You know what I mean? It's going DA. Don't worry about that, man. Yeah, that's what... Wait, so answer that question. So water outside, does it freeze? Or I don't have to worry about that. The game doesn't get that crazy with it. All right, there's our traps. See, I like these ones so much better. Are any of them trapped or none of them? That should be far enough. It said it only has to be 75 tiles away, and this is definitely way more than 75 tiles. Yeah, you would have to boil all of it, depending on where you got it from, though. Yeah. Like, even this water, I have to boil it if I want to use it. Um, I got my campfire here. I grab my cooking pots, and I just start boiling away. All right. So, snack on something for Din. Dinskis. I think we have a sandwich, don't we? Yeah, I got a couple more sandwiches in there I could eat. is actually empty so let's fill that up before we get thirsty oh let me uh dump this damn yeah we don't need this watering can on us anymore let's fill up our water Uh, what day am I on? That's a good question. We are on one month, 12 days, 19 hours, and we have a l almost 1,200 zombies killed. All right, let me see if I have a... I don't know if we even have any sheets of paper. I don't think so. All right, let's get to bed. Got a big day ahead of us tomorrow. I want to do some so to do jarring I'm gonna need jars vinegar and um, lids I know I have about five jars with lids right now um, oh look at that and it's already raining we beat the game all right so we'll eat All right, let me uh, let me get this list open over here. All right, so what do we need, guys? Let's make a list right now. What do we need? We need vinegar. Or jars. Lids. Um, we're also on the box of screws.
Um, what was the other stuff I said earlier that we needed to look for, guys, that we're, we're going to go out and loot for? I'm making a list right now. So we just have a... Everything we need. Let me actually pause the game so we're not wasting uh, daylight. Sugar. Oh, we need All right, so we got vinegar, jars, lids, screws, sugar. There was other, like, vital things that I can't really remember. Yeah, I want to take notes in game, Giovanna, but I need to find some sheets of paper. So that's what we're going to do also. Let's find some paper. We can just do everything. Awesome. Yeah, I'm actually writing a, a nice little shopping list right now to go out. Um, so what else do we need? What else do we need, guys? Let me see. Let me take inventory. So what are we looking at right now? Do I have any? I think I already have a little bit of vinegar, right? So I got three jars. One of them's almost empty. We got a little bit of vinegar. Do I have any sugar? I know I haven't really been grabbing any sugar. So we're going to head down to probably Southern Rosewood again. And uh, we'll go loot in there. Oh, um, what else do we need? I don't know. I don't know, guys. I don't remember what we need. But we need to fill up our gun with bullets. I'm going to grab a couple extra mags. No, we're good. We're plenty good on fuel right now. I got, um, got 12 full gas cans right there and another 12. So I got 24 gas cans full. All right, nine mil mags. Let's grab, and those are all full, aren't they? Nope, these two are. Let's grab those, throw those in the backpack. And do we have any more duct tape? Let me go see if we have any more duct tape. Oh, MREs, yes, MREs, MREs. Alan. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, duct tape, duct tape, duct tape. I think we're out. So can electrical tape be used? Maybe packing tape. I want to see if these tapes can be used to make a suppressor. I don't think they can, though. Nope. Yeah, we need to get our hands on some more duct tape then. Oh, wrong, 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 uh, storage. Yeah, I've been saving up, uh, we also need to be on the lookout for, um, extra water bottles because making these suppressors is super vital right now because we don't have any other way to suppress our guns. And I ran out of freaking duct tape making the other ones I made. Alright, so we got, what, four mags... That should be enough ammo. Uh, I don't plan on using any of it. I honestly kind of want to just equip my katana. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Um, we got a crossbow. Yep, we got a crossbow here. Uh, I got bolts. Let's grab some bolts. And non-perishables. Yeah, we're just going to grab anything non-perishable. Non-perishable food. Oh, and yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, 
And then you guys were talking about a um a wood stove to heat. So, so we're gonna keep our eyes open for a wood stove. My wagon. Yeah, I don't I'm, I'm gonna have to wait to get that. And get exactly Bruce like yeah, and that's it man like it's like real life dude You could sit here and spend all this time building all this up and then just get killed uh, Let me see so can I I just want to make sure my mags are topped off. I Had a few of these magazines that weren't full this one And this one And we'll throw the rest of this 9 mil in the back of the truck. Fine. I grab my bolts and let's head out. So I got. Y'all, look. Yeah, we have tons of bolts. Holy crap. Um, We'll grab what? Three bundles? Three bundles should be more than enough. We'll actually keep two of them in the trunk. Or. A lot of bolts. That's a lot of bolts. Um, I'm actually gonna grab half and let's equip this on our back. All right, we're good to go. Yeah, the generator. Yeah. This will minimize my list right now. It's very, very bright over there. Just eat a herb. Yep. Yeah. Exactly, dude. That I think that's one of the most appealing things about this game, Bruce. Is just how brutal and real it is to just you know have all this going for you, you know, you're just going on a simple shopping trip, you know what I mean? Like, this isn't anything crazy, I'm just going on a quick trip down to South Rosewood, I'm gonna hit some houses, you know, and this little baby loot run could turn into me getting bit. Yeah, it doesn't take very much. I'm gonna start babying my car a little more because I don't want to break them. As I smack into a zombie. Trunk. How do I want to sector this off? School could be our base ground, like where we uh, just park. Carol. <laughs> All right, so the school will be our home base. That was a good shot.
deal with anybody coming in. Let's grab our bolts back. Oh, and an empty water bottle. Start with these houses up here. this garbage can how much does this hold oh it's got a garbage bag oh these ones hold a lot oh we might grab one of those later on let's check this house no alarm baby please no alarm House sounds clear. Nope, I hear something. Yep. Oh, I missed. Let's see if we can flank around. Got him. Yeah, this is the room we were in. Somebody in the living room? Got him. So nerve wracking, guys. It really is. Ah, oh, motherfucker! Christ, Carol! <laughs> just keeping me on my toes? Shit! I just went through a hit W and I freaking whispered. Alright, let's get to searching. Pretty much all, any food we find. Oh, can of whipped cream? Get out of here, Sway. You know we're taking that. Uh, nope. Vinegar. Look at that. Camp peas. So we're hitting our shopping list already. Of course, we're going to take matches. All right. So this house really didn't have a whole lot. Fill our water. Why not? We don't need any of that. Duct tape. Oh my god. Seriously? Alright, it sounds like they're at the front door. So we're going to make our way back out the way we came in. Close the window. We're going to smoke a cigarette really quick. Auto on. Uh, I don't believe so. I don't... All right, so we're going to head across the street now. 
And we'll start making our way down that way. Okay, so we just got these two right here. Load a bolt, baby. Yeah, we got a huge group up there. My goal is to just get as many bolts back as possible. Our house seems clear. Uh yes, Michael. Uh, I oh, my whole my whole uh, uniform here is all covered in leathered patches. Because we got a shopping list right now, and, and I don't want to fill up my inventory with stuff that's not on the list. We got to stick to the plan, man. If I grabbed everything that I could use in the future, I would just be full up constantly, you know what I mean? So, I'm here with a shopping list. When we get to the point where we, we want to start doing some books, we'll come back for them later on. Grab the cigs, grab that lighter. Nice. Um, take the cigs. Well, that, and I also already read most of the books. Primal, I read, a, like, probably, like, 60-plus books off stream. So a lot of the books I already have. All right, we're good to go here. Let's check the back of this cop car really quick. Got to stick to the plan, guys. Stick to the plan. Oh, uh, Rob, you can. I have a map of the area. And you can actually make notes all over the map. Like, you can write all over the map. Um, and you could write, like, you know, I found this in this house. And you can come back to it later on. That is definitely something you can do. Oh, yes. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I, I, sh I should try to get my hands on some more duffels. Deal with these guys. One. Two. Okay. 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to definitely do those books. But because I did the multiplier, uh, you said I didn't have to even start worrying about that until I got to the higher levels, right? Like, for instance, like these, a lot of these books right here, like, see, they're not even like real books. They're just like happiness. Oh, we do need some paper, though. Um, And then these are like expert books and shit like that. You know what I mean? Like, I could use those way later in the game, like level seven and eight for fishing. But I feel like once I get up to those levels, I'll, I'll just go look for those books if I really need them. But something like this, make, like, I want that. Explosive textbook, that sounds awesome. That sounds awesome. But like making magnets, like, bro, I'm not gonna be making no magnets. Uh, everything's rotten. Eggs are rotten. Let's see what's in the freezer. Nothing. Oh, this house was trash. No, and I get that problem. I mean, yeah, that is a, that is oh antibiotics. That is a very fair point. You know what I mean, like. But the only thing I, I, cause I was doing that before I was just grabbing everything under the sun, but then I was running out of, why do they have birth control pills? Like what the hell? Um, I was just running out of inventory cause I was constantly just filling up on everything constantly. And I was never able to get the stuff that I went out to get. So that, that's all I'm doing now is I'm just kind of trying to prioritize the stuff that I actually came out for. But I don't want to fill up my inventory with books. In, in my in my experience, I don't live long enough to use half of them anyway. <laughs> uh, I believe so. I believe fanny packs are part of Hydrocraft. Here we go. So we're already going to have to make our first dump. We're getting full. Build boxes and collect hydro containers like forklifts. A forklift, man. We got another sheet of paper. Yeah, yeah, for sure. But I have been, I have been neg neglecting the, uh, the knowledge parts of the game, but I made sure I, I read on this character specifically that we uh, took a lot of time and read a lot of the books. All right, so I know we've already hit these houses down here, so we're going to head back up to the school and then we're going to go down the street there. Actually, just take these guys out. Crossbow OP, guys. Yeah, I got, I have one of the hand carts, uh, the, uh, the two handed ones back at base. Um, that's what I was using for when I was, uh, trying to move a lot of wood.
Oh, that's a survival axe. Is that any good? I always use weapons. Yeah, I had my freaking. Oh, uh, I had my. I left my tr my hand truck back at the outpost. So we definitely got to make sure we grab that. All right, so we'll dump this in the trunk. I am happy about that duct tape find, though. That was clutch. We could actually make another suppressor right now. Can I, or does it have to be the other one? Yeah, I, I don't think we can actually. Alright, so do we empty out? Yeah. I need a screwdriver, I think. I don't I don't remember exactly what I need, but Alright, so we're gonna start hitting these houses. The durability, um I don't know, dude. I, it looked like it was still max condition right now. Yeah, so the condition is still pretty good. I feel like the crossbow should last a really long time. Where'd that zombie go? So we're just going to try to avoid them altogether. Oh, that bolt broke. I think we have enough bowls for right now. A juicer? What can that be used for? I don't know. Uh, dog food, it's a non-perishable. Why not? If we get desperate enough. I guess we'll eat about just about anything. All this... All that food... Bring the bleach. No. Oh yeah, check craft helper. I forgot all about that, dude. I think the juicer is a uh, hydro craft item. Oh shit, so you can actually just... Oh, let's grab that. That's good, guys. So you could, I could, I could juice a carrot. And make a bottle of carrot juice. Yeah, we're grabbing that. 
Definitely grabbing that. That is a good find, man. That is such a good find. Oh, melted ice cream. Oh, but I feel... Yeah, that's super fattening sounding, though. We're on a... Let's see what our weight is, actually. 85 and going down still, yeah. We're no longer overweight, though. We finally lost our overweight, guys. So, so we just found out that um, the melted ice cream never goes bad. We never have too many cooking pots, honestly. Yeah, the flavored stuff, yeah. But the, the good thing is the flavored stuff... Uh, there's sugar. I was like, I know I see the thing of sugar. Um, the flavored stuff counts as food. Hunger, like, you get quite a bit of hunger from it. That's why I'm, uh... Be on a nice little juicing diet. Alright, let's head out. What is this little teeny ass house? Quite a small apartment. All rotten. All right, so we are getting a little tired. Um, thinking where can we maybe spend the night that felt safe ish? There's actually a lot of zombies here at the school. Mm. Thinking maybe. We can sleep in a truck. Yeah, we'll sleep in the in the vehicle. That should have me safe, right? Oh, frying pan, Casper. Thank you so much, dude. Yeah, we got to get it. Definitely got to get a frying pan.
And I haven't seen a wood stove. I don't even know. What to do. Um, I guess as long as you you're they can't yeah they can't, as long as they can't get into your window you're good. So let's see. Um. We, holy shit, we got a lot of bullets in our car. We got almost a thousand rounds of nine mil, and I thought I was running out. Hey, Baron, get that good sleep, man. Thank you so much for popping in. Um, we got to grab some food, though. Oh, there's stuff on the seat. Yep. We'll put those in the glove box. And then we can get out like that if we need to. Um, I'm just going to grab some food out the trunk. I think we got something we can eat, right? Yeah, we got an empty bottle. Right, where's our empty bottle at? Grab that. And we'll grab this MRE. All right, so once again, for those of you guys who haven't seen how cool the damn MREs are, and for those of you guys that have actually utilized MREs in real life, watch how awesome these things are. So we're going to open up our MRE. All right, so it gives you all of the ingredients, right? Look at this, that you would get in a real MRE. We got the crackers. We got the drink packets, the meals, your main meal, side meal, uh, we got the wheat snack bread. We got salt pepper to flavor our foods with. Um, it came with this one came with chocolate. We got our uh, the heater. Um, this is an empty package. We got alcohol wipes that came out the little uh, little part. It came with matches. So this is awesome. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add water, and we're gonna use it's gonna use the salt, the pepper, and it's gonna heat our main meal and our side meal. Boom. So we got corned beef hash and chow mein noodles. And then we're also going to mix our drink into this bottle. And we have tomato juice. So look at all that. And we have alcohol wipes for just in case we get injured. Let me go throw all this trash away. I don't want it bogging down my inventory. So that's why I was saying you could really make an MRE last. All you need is water. Um, so we'll throw. Just throwing the stuff in the trash. With a lot of wooden crates. Okay, I got some factories that are actually pretty close to my uh, base we might head up to. Alright, so let's eat some food. Uh, we'll eat our, our this for dinner. Made tar primal drink toilet water. <laughs> uh, Chris, uh, Hunt Showdown is... It's a, that's a, definitely a great game, man. But I treated everybody that I played as good. You know what I mean? Like, Primal just got unlucky. So that should be enough food for now. Let's uh, smoke. You know what? I might actually peek into this school. We got a little bit of time left before I want to go to sleep. Um, so let me... Uh, let's drop the rest of this food into our backpack.
Perfect. I know, Primal. I'm sorry, dude. I really didn't want you to die, man. Primal did die alone in the woods. And then the second time I played as Primal, he, uh, he got lost in the woods again. I want to see if this place has a cafeteria. It's a school, so obviously it has a cafeteria. I just don't know where the hell it is, and I don't know how many zombies are in this place, so... Maybe it's over here? Yep, I see the lunch tables. Nice. That one. Of course we're taking the batteries. All right, we got to go around to get into the kitchen area. All right, so this is the actual kitchen area. Whoa. Everything in the fridges are gonna be bad. Oh man, look at all that food though. There was all types of stuff in here. Apple candy, why not? Really silent? Oh, dude. Bottle of ammonia, sunflower seeds. No, we don't need any of that crap. We'll eat these right now. Oh, uh, that's something for like sciencey shit. Yeah, this is all sciencey shit. Like, add ammonia to morphine hydrochlorides. What the fuck? <laughs> what? Vinegar. Beautiful. Mac and cheese. Beautiful. Why? What happened? Oh, okay. Hell yeah. Well, there it is, running late. Yeah. The small Tupperware, that's empty. Now, mops and brooms, guys, these are cool because you can break them into spears. Yeah, all this stuff's rotten. All right, let's head to the car, get some sleep. Yeah, I would... Uh, well, we have a ton of compost right now, but... Grabbing all that rotten food right now is just going to bog down my inventory. Um, and we have so much, uh, like, food we're growing back at base. We're going to have our own rotten food. So we did get a little bit of more vinegar. We got some sugar. All right, so we'll keep some of this on for us for breakfast in the morning. Uh, where is it? Right here. We're going to eat that in the morning, and then we'll keep that tomato juice on us. And now that we have that juicer, we're going to be able to make our own tomato juice without MREs. 
All right, let's get that sleep. Blood vamp, Semper Fi, dude. How are you? My day has been going good, man. Um, well, I can't say it's been going super good because we ran into some technical difficulties with the stream, but. Painkillers on them. All right, so we're gonna head across the street now. Um, let me actually grab my flashlight. It's a little dark. Actually have quite a few zombies over on the side of the fence. About what, four of them? Five of them, actually. Easy. Holy shit! This guy had an axe on him. Yeah, so the, that that horde down there, that is crazy big. I mean, we could crossbow that whole entire group. Whoa, what the hell is going on in here? Looks like a party. Pour that on the ground. Got a plan. Got a plan. Well, oh, I got a plan. Yeah, we're taking care of that group. It's a, it's a big group, and um, I'd rather not have them hanging around the area. Oh, 
Oh, there's a duffel over there, though. I'm not gonna risk my life, though, for a duffel. Stop by the car really quick. So we're siphoning some gasoline. Put those in there. Gas can in the trunk. It'll all make sense here in a second, guys. Fucking meta event had to ruin everything. Might have worked in my favor, though.
Okay, so nobody's got to wait. Two minutes for that to go. Get our Molotov prepped. I set the alarm for 9.30. There we go. Should be going off any second now. There it is. Set it for 9.30 a.m., right? Why did the alarm go off? There it is. It is going. We're just not hearing it. I thought they would have heard that. Whatever. Oh, there's still a huge group up here. Why did that not explode? Did you guys see that? A noisemaker? Well, it failed anyways. What the hell? Let's hit these houses. We're wasting time. So we'll grab this water. I had a lighter. I, I put the lighter in my secondary.
suppressor's gone. Damn, I wasn't trying to get bloody. Haven't been picking my crossbow bolts back up. Where did that one even go? Yo, Darla's so strong, guys. Yo, my bolts are just gone. That's the party house. Alright, so I'm going to head up this way now. Um, actually, let's go grab our vehicle. <laughs> Down with Dara. Hashtag justice for primal. Care. I mean, what can kill Darla, you know what I mean? I would have to, I feel like I would have to just do, like, I'd have to purposely get her killed. We're gonna drink all of this. <laughs> well, I hope you guys are doing, you know, like, I feel like if you guys are playing at the same time I am, we're all winning together, you know what I mean? We're all beating the game. So the problem is, is I, I have no more suppressed shots out of this. So, yeah. We're going to have to pretty much uh, cross blow it up. Yeah, the, the Molly ate me. <laughs> Eight mile later, I swear I had it equipped in my secondary. I mean, I might not have, but. I'm... Now, like I said, Darla doesn't like blood. So that's why I'm trying to keep all these zombies at range the best I can. Yeah, I wish I would have brought some vitamins. I don't need to fight that zombie. I think I have a couple hand crossbows back at base, the little tiny ones. Um, the only reason why I was using this one over that is because this one I have has more range. Oh shit. Oh, oh. We're good. We're good. I'm going to clear out these guys in the back here. I'm going to grab that duffel. Another bag for us to load up in our hands.
That's what I'm talking about, Darla. Damn, all these bolts broke. Grab that duffel bag. I got a decent amount of bolts. Bruce said my mustache? I feel like my mustache is pretty weak. Oh, we got a fanny pack. We can wear that. Nice. Got our nice little fanny pack. A little bit of extra... A little extra storage there. Yeah, we already read both of those. I do want the paper though. Let's grab this paper. Toothpaste and toothbrush. Got you, Darla. Well, toothpaste right there. Now we just gotta get you a toothbrush. Um, that's yeah, good. A pack of pop. Got all that stuff on my... <laughs> Oh, you can? Nice, dude. That, that'll be so much easier than if I just grab one of them empty notebooks. Oh, we'll grab the bottle of wine. So the loot is not powerful right now. I'm not, I'm not feeling the... This road? Take care of business, Darla. Look at that. Look at all them bolts getting broke. I actually might grab that hoodie though. So we'll hit this house in this house. Tomorrow, was, you said the game is too easy? Damn. Got you guys calling me out now. I'm playing on Apocalypse. Apocalypse was the hardest.
I thought survival was normal. See how you see how they're doing me, guys? Now they're saying I'm I'm on the easy mode. <laughs> now I'm on easy mode. Yeah, I'm playing on high pop. I, I'm on high population apocalypse. Um, yeah, it's not like I'm a, I'm not a builder anymore. You know what I mean? So you guys are saying apocalypse really isn't hard? I thought this shit was really hard. It's just cause it's, uh, it's how I'm playing, you know what I mean guys? I'm, I'm just making it look easy, right? No, runners and super zeds. Yeah, those are in the base game. You can create them, but it's not like it's that's not a base game mode at all. That's a like a that's a hardcore thing. Oh, here we go. Yep, we got both of those. So what does C D D A stand for? What is that? No, no, I didn't disable. They're not enabled, uh, Primal, like super zombies. That's not something that's just base. Like you have to want to play with super zombies. Like there's no setting in the game that like gives you super zombies. You have to actually go in the zombie settings and make super zombies. See if we get some duct tape out of here. Oh yeah, the naked and the wounded and the yeah. I don't mind six months later, you know what I mean? Like that that's legit. That shit's hard. Um, I haven't been able to survive six months later yet. Yeah, yeah, they're not a part of the normal game, no. Uh, Darla, I can't find you a damn toothbrush. Like, seriously? Well, what we'll, we can do is once we, uh, get back to base, um, I already looted this kitchen, didn't I? I'll finish my, my chores with Darla. And then, um, 
We can do a scenario, not a scenario, but we can do a six months later survivor. But it's all that six months later gameplay that's making me better, you know what I mean? Alright, I, let me actually shoot this guy. Remove the glass. another zombie in this house there she is what is that mod called Uh, Bruce, I did turn on extreme rare loot. This game mode right here, I have extreme rare loot on. Um, all of everything. Everything is extremely rare. Food, uh, everything. Apple jello packets. That sounds cool. Cocoa powder. Let's grab that. Baby food. Cherry snacks. Those are pop tarts. I'll grab some more flour. Yeah, I already went ahead and made all the loot extremely rare. There we go. Beam, spam, sugar. I haven't gotten lucky yet and found like a case of jars. I mean, maybe I gotta like check garages for those. Yeah, I got Hydrocraft installed. Oh, good shot. Okay, okay. 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 And Darla said, what's next? Um, excuse me. was a solar panel what is that oh shit
Wow, dude. Look at that, though. I need electrical level 7. You need four solar panels, steel pole, battery array, copper, red LEDs, yellow LEDs, switches, display, power cords, a solder gun with solder and electronics work. Dude, that is insanity. Yeah, that, that seemed like next level, dude, to craft that. Did we already check this house? No, we didn't. An improvised device used to remotely def detonate crafted bombs. Hmm. Like an IED switch. Wow. Crafted timer. Shit, I'll grab one of those. I got, I grabbed the rice cooker last time, guys. I couldn't do anything with it. Oh, wait. Is it because I didn't insert a freaking battery into it? Oh, shit. Hold on. Maybe you can use a rice cooker. I just didn't have a battery in mine. But it takes a medium battery. I don't. Uh, let me see. How much does this thing weigh? Yeah, we'll grab it. I think I already have one back at base, but I don't know if I got rid of it. Oh, let's uh, actually drink this right now. This will help with our tiredness. Dracos. GG, dude. Welcome back. Oh, you can just eat coffee, dude? <laughs> that doesn't sound like it's gonna taste good. Oh, yes, look at that. That's a big find right there. Still no jars, though.
So here's a map of Rosewood. We're gonna take that. Um, because then we can go back to our base and we can like sit there and annotate on the map where we've looted and where we haven't. A trunk. Stack of cardboard boxes. Those could be useful later on. Kill Bill Katana. That sounds fucking awesome. Okay. What you guys are saying is Darla is too OP. Darla, they're saying you're too OP. What do we do about that, Darla? Like, what do you think about that, Darla? That you have been labeled as too overpowered. I'll take this pasta. Oh, is my bag full? It is. I'll be right there with you, Andrew, here in a, in a moment. As soon as we get OP Darla back home. Darla is... Is, uh... She's beat the game. Right, let's head back down to the car. Getting late. We've got a decent amount of loot. <laughs> Great ghost. Did you do it again? Yeah, that freaking hurt my heart, dude. Wait, I can attach that katana to my side belt? Oh shit, I can. We legit have a katana on our side belt. That zombie actually has a crossbow on him. I think it's the same one we have right now or the other. I forgot the other version of it is called. Yeah, the scout. Yeah, we, we're good. I'm not going to kill Darla. I don't know. Darla's our, our, our long-term character, guys. We got a lot of uh, stuff we still need to do with Darla here. There is a lot of zombies down here though. I did not expect there to be this many.
feel like the game gets easier too once you get a car. So I got an idea for this next uh, little bit we're about to do. All right, so we have nothing that's gonna go bad. We'll, I'll sort all this stuff out later on. Like our generator, 87% fuel. The condition. So how do you? Fix the generator, though. That's the only thing I'm... I'm trying to figure out. So our generator is degrading pretty quickly. Yeah, look at this, guys. Darla is a freaking powerhouse. Katana. Got a nice little knife. Got a crossbow on her. Then she's got a nice little handgun. No suppressor though, but handgun. Electrical parts. Let me see. Do I have electrical parts? I have scraps of electronics. Is that is that the same thing? Wait, if it goes below 50, it'll catch fire? Scraps of electronics. Okay, yep. I have some of those. Use one, use two, use three, four. Why is it? Okay, it's maxed out. It actually uses quite a bit of electronics, I'm not gonna lie. Quentin, what's up, dude? so here we go guys that was another episode with darla um now we're gonna just swap over i'm not gonna drop the stream we'll keep the stream up we're gonna drop in and we're gonna do a um a hard playthrough seeing as you guys are saying this is easy i didn't think apocalypse was easy i just felt like i, ha I had it under control you know what i mean I felt like I wasn't bad at the game anymore. All right. So, let me see. I think Primal died, right? Yeah. Our last, yeah, a couple people died. When was this one? 326. I don't remember what that one was. All right. So, this is our Darla game. We're going to go down here. Solo. Custom Sandbox. But look, it says right here, right? So we have Builder, which is easy. Then you have Survivor, which is normal. It says powerful combat, longer lifespan, a challenging playstyle based on PZ's previous survival mode, right? And then Apocalypse. Stealth focus, short lifespan, combat best avoided. That sh that raccoon has a fucking eye patch on. That means that shit is hard. So, what we're going to do here is I'm going to go I got all my mods, right? Yeah, all my mods are on.
and we're gonna make it hard i'm gonna make it really hard so we're gonna go what is studio yeah we tried this one last time and we died so quick it, that shit was hard um yeah we'll just go custom sandbox right got all my mods we're gonna start um all right carol what's up can you how you doing man surely how are you all right carol you're back up because i didn't give you a fair chance before pick where you want to go carol i'm gonna let carol choose everything i'm gonna let her choose her skills everything and this is how we'll do it i'm gonna i'm gonna swap people actually no silent is next i gotta do silent carol i gotta do silent and then i'll do you is silent still here i promised silent he would be next and he's been waiting hold on carol i'm sorry i'm sorry unless silent wants you to go first I've had silent waiting for like two months, guys. Because Darla's just been alive this whole time. All right, silent. Do you want do you want this playthrough or do you want it to be Carol? The island mod? What is that? I'll check that out, Gaunts. That sounds cool. Survival, like just surviving on an island. All right, silent. All right, so pick where you want to spawn, where you want to go, silent. Location. Everybody's been waiting. I know Darla's, Darla just hasn't died. And I'm going to try my best to survive, no matter what. No matter what skills you guys pick, no matter what, I'm going to try. King's Mouth is an island. Yeah, so pick what area you want to go to. And while you're while I'm getting all the, the, the menu and stuff set up, uh, start pre-planning what you want your skills to be like maybe what you want your job to be um, start thinking of some positive and negatives things like that that you want to have West Point all right uh, so do you want West Point or West Point expansion so I have both <laughs> chill nation I really appreciate that man All right, so we just need to know West Point or West Point expansion. I don't know. I don't think I've really been to West Point before, honestly. That's a. Uh... Oh, every town is high pop. West Point is suicide. Oh man. Well, silent. Hey. Expansion. So we're going West Point expansion. All right, so while I'm setting this up, silent, start typing up what you want um, your, your skills to be. So zombie count, I'm gonna go to my, my um, we'll go six months later. Now, do I have to keep it on insane, guys? Or should I lower it to very high? I feel like insane is like, is it a lot of zombies? Or should we just leave it? I don't have How to Survive, Camille. I've actually never played How to Survive ever a day in my life.
insane. So do all the, I guess all the pros play on inside insane. All right, we'll go insane. I'm not, I'm not worried about it. I'm not worried about it. All right, so the the everything's instant. House alarms never. Month six, whatever, whatever. Nature, that's all good. Um. Should I um? I have like something in my tooth, and it's like. Um. Should I turn the heli event off then? Since it's six months later? Yeah, we're turning it off because that doesn't make sense. Uh, meta will make generators extremely rare. Um, we're going to make this all this stuff extremely rare. Uh, we're gonna change this to 72. <laughs> Not all of the pros, but a few of them. All right, so we're gonna everything extremely rare. And then once we get to this point, I'm gonna save this preset because this will just be Everything set on extremely rare. Character, I will get my um, 4% XP multiplier. Um, all that's normal. We'll go with our, I forgot what I was running before. I think I was running 30. Um, normal, normal, normal. Multi-hit on certain weapons. All right, vehicles. Um, car spawn rate. Very low. Chance has gas low. Initial gas, very low. Um, lock frequency is never. General condition is very low. All right, so all that's set extremely low. And we'll leave the zombies normal. The only thing I like to lower is this, because this shit is... They, they, they see too much. And advanced zombie options. Oh, that's 400%. Oh, we don't want no 400%, dude. Yeah, we don't want no 400%. That's crazy. Go to 1.5. Yeah, that, okay. If that's how it works, 1.5. Oh, okay. We won't go no free points. We'll get rid of all the easy stuff. Is there anything else easy that I was putting on there? Yeah, I don't have the more traits. I, I need to get that mod, actually. can't have more <laughs> all right all right guys all right i turn it off i turn it off all right now for example I, I took all that off i took it off we're good we're good zombie lord will make the zombies strong okay or uh not superhuman no i'm just gonna what what is their normal yeah we'll make them normal All right, multi-hit is gone. All right. All right, let's get, let's save this. 
as pro player. All right, so for traits, uh, overweight. I thirst Smoker Low Reader for the negatives um on strong cat eyes An outdoorsman. So, what do you want your job to be? Um, silent. Yeah, we're doing we're doing six months later. Silent. So, yeah, high thirst is gonna be kind of scary. So, you want to remove high thirst then? An electrician. Okay. All right. So if we get rid of high thirst, we will need another plus six. Yeah, we'll need another plus six, which will either be um, out of shape, rest of sleeper, slow healer, which I advise slow healer. That one's super easy to work around. And uh, slow learner. So you want to go with maybe a slow healer? It's up to you though. That doesn't matter. Or we could do two smaller ones or whatever. Drink all the bathtubs. Drinking all the bath water. <laughs> slow healer. Okay. All right. So these are our negatives. Uh, he wanted electrical so we can go for that early game generator and um, Here we go Silent I got to give you chest hair dude I'm going to make you look awesome. Are you ready for this? Silent, how old are you? Eight hundred hours, dude. That's a lot, man. I don't even think I've hit a hundred. I probably hit a hundred so far. He looks good how he is. Oh, <laughs> uh, I mean that does look pretty good. All right, sounds he'd be twenty three. So we got it. We got We got him. Let's see. Let's see. I just clicked that one. Uh, the fans too much. The fans too much. Uh, should we give them? Um... Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. There it is. Or silent. Give me. What is your. Uh, what is your uh, ethnicity? Yeah, I'll just. I'll just build off your ethnicity. You tell me what your ethnicity is, and I'll try to make you the best I can.
I mean, I thought that looked pretty good. Look at that. All right. So then, <laughs> this is gonna, we're gonna give you an awesome ass goatee. Um, and that hair is on point. Uh, I don't know about these glasses though. Uh, thin frame, we could go. No, 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 no. Yeah, we'll stick with the thin frame. Type ones. We're gonna go with. Make sure you have more uh, a lot of clothes on because it's gonna be cold. Go long sleeve. <laughs> it does look like Breaking Bad. Long socks, canvas shoes. Yeah, we'll go with the canvas shoes. Make a silent ginger out of like zombie souls. <laughs> All right, so I'm loving it. Let's change the color of this damn lumberjack shirt, though, because we need it to keep you warm. I'm not a fan of the uh, color. The red. Hell yes. Um, jeans will go with those. Perfect. And perfect. That's that, that looks good. That looks good. Let's do it. Oh, you actually had red hair? Oh, man. Two seconds. Two seconds too late. I could probably dye your hair in game, though, if we find some hair dye. We'll try to find some hair dye. That'll be a mission. Here we go, guys. So this is, all right, before we start this, this is, uh, this is like pro player levels of difficulty, right? Before we step into this, this hell hole, I want to know if I'm playing like lethal dark side levels of Project Zomboid right now. You ain't gonna find shit. <laughs> okay. All right, let's do it. Our, we gotta just try hard. All right. So, so another thing is that you guys gotta remember is I've never been to the city. So unlike Rosewood, I actually have no idea where the hell I am. So we're gonna grab a battery. That sounds like a plan. So where the hell did they spawn us? What is this? Is that a weapon? Oh, we got a weapon. Well, I don't know what the hell it is, but it, what the fuck is a keytar? Is that like one of them? It is. Uh, it's one of those uh, keyboard. <laughs> yeah, we're not using that. We'll hold on to it just in case we don't find anything else. All right, so let's equip the scarf. All right, so there's already a billion zombies across the way there. Gun case. Yeah, we're not worried about guns right now.
Uh, ammo canister. Does it have ammo in it? No. I think it's empty. Let me see. Is it empty? Yeah, it's empty. All right, here we go. Long gloves. We're going to wear those. Um, we're going to check the alarm on this. No alarm. Keep the clock on us so we have now we can tell time. Rip this up. We'll rip this up. Oh, yes. Here we go. Pour out the bleach. All right. So we're going to be good on water. Um, so I'm going to completely fill this freaking bleach bottle. Awesome. Um, I wouldn't mind... Bag now. Something to hold some water in. Or uh, items in. All right, here we go. Here's the kitchen. Here's the kitchen. Pumpkin spice. Oh. <laughs> Too easy, guys. Matches. Gar oh. All right, goodbye, Kitar. Hello, crafted spear. Box of garbage bags? Bruh. Uh, we'll grab one cleaning liquid. I don't know if that's really something we need right now, but... Throw all this stuff in here for right now. Oh, you can just drop them on the ground? Okay. Hell yes. Look at all this. It's not the greatest look ever, but it's good. You know what I mean? Cherry jello packet. So I need a saucepan with water. Yeah, that see jello is way beyond our uh, current capabilities. Oh, we got a water bottle. All right. Let's see what's behind this place. All right. So, this is like an apartment complex it seems. Um I'm wondering if I can get next door. chip bag okay so, so the pumpkin carving knife that's not like a close quarters bladed weapon I'll take it grab a bowl All this stuff's so good. We should have enough resources to skip town if, if this town really is that. Oh, yeah. Look at this. If this town is really that bad. So in here. 
hear some zombies. I need to turn this off, whatever that is. I don't even know how it's still on. Alright, let me, uh, I just want a jacket. A jacket would be super nice. Alright, got another layer on, which is cool. That'll keep us warm. Holy shit. What the hell am I supposed to do? Right, let's read this. Hear that? All right, so the steel pipe. Um, yeah, we'll grab that. Got, got matches. How many ma yeah, we only got one book of matches. We could start a fire with that, so that's all that matters. I'm uh, pulling out some pages. Uh, oh, those are way too heavy. Um, I just wanted to grab a couple pages so I could uh, use them to start a fire. Shit. Alright, um, we have one more apartment right here we could check. We got a zombie right there. We're good. Uh, let's grab this baby food. All right. Um, I think we're doing pretty good now for loot wise. We do need to find somewhere. This area is not bad. Like, I, I mean, this apartment building isn't the worst, but, um, there's no way I, I, I can serve. Like, you guys seen the amount of zombies that are out in front of here? Give me a jacket. We just got to find, like, a little base of operations that we can, like, work out of. This actually has a gun in it. Doesn't have a magazine. Shoots 380. Extended stock. Yeah, but we, we don't have what it takes to shoot that gun right now. Like, we don't have the magazine. We don't have the ammo. We don't have a way to suppress it right now. So I'm thinking for now, we're going to stay here. Um, it's relatively safe and yeah, we're going to stay here, stay right on this end apartment. 
So we'll drop our our bag of loot right here. Oh, hold on. <laughs> oh, I yeah, dyed your hair, but your goatee is still the same color. All right, so let's um, let's drop our garbage bag in the house. Um, I am going to go back in the other apartments. I'm going to try to get my hands on all the sheets so I can cover the windows. Ah! Oh, you motherfucker! <laughs> Silent, I think we're doing great, dude. This spawn is amazing. Alright, so we got our garbage bag right here. Getting a little hungry, but it's not anything we need to worry about yet. Um, let's start close let's start securing this place. all of this all right so I can actually just remove these curtains so I'm not gonna come in this front room stay out of that room our bathroom oh I want to see can I cover these windows Okay, you can. All right, so we're gonna have to go check all these other apartments and try to get all of the sheets that we can get our hands on. That area was clear. So this is our new base. Um, let me go to that front room. Just survive in these apartments and never leave.
Okay, so how do I add a sheet rope to a window, guys? So I got a sheet rope. No, we got this. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're, we got this. I'm not, let me actually see what's in here while I'm waiting for you guys to tell me. Uh, so we got another spear if we need it. Um, oh, I gotta take the curtains off. Oh, so I need two. I need two sheet ropes then. All right, gotcha. And a nail. Oh, we don't have none of that. Alright, let's let's check out these apartments. Alright, so our sheet rope idea is gonna have to wait. Or we got a bag of sunflower seeds. Canned pineapples. More matches. Eat this right now. All right, so we haven't been able to find any smoke. Chairs have nails. I, I I think I need a hammer though in order. To, you can still jump with the chair. Okay, well I mean yeah, I'd rather you know risk a broken leg than get mauled into pieces, but um. So for now, let's dump our can opener back in our bag. We're going to be living out this bag for a little while. Alright, so we're still good on water. Um, let's go uh, check next door. Let me see what the bathroom has, actually. Uh, check the bedroom over here. See if we have a jacket. Fanny pack. Hell yes. Earmuffs. That's definitely going to help with the cold. Hammer, hammer, hammer. Multi-tool saw? That might count as a saw, maybe. No, it's a... No, it's a... It goes to a... It's like one of them uh, attachments to like a multi... Like an electric saw. Not what we're looking for. Damn it. Damn apartment next door. Okay, it still has stuff here though. Alright, so we're gonna actually break both of these. All 
All right, so I'm able to get myself a couple more spears. Then that horde sounds like it's tearing through the building. Later. Swap that for our matches. Silent, I don't know what to do, man. I don't know how to turn that radio off. Couldn't even find it. Or is it upstairs? Is that up here? I think it's downstairs. I, I don't know where it was. I looked for it. I couldn't find it. We got that little thing where every like minute or so the game like freezes for a second. So I think you guys said the way to fix that is by um, restarting the game, right? I don't know, Gaunts. The zombies and it just makes it so. I, I love the challenge. Like I, the zombies make it hard. You know what I mean to go anywhere. So we got tons of loot. Um, oh, there's shelves up here I didn't even look at. Make Christmas cookies. Make yeah, that that's good stuff. Bourbon. Ooh, yes. And another water bottle. So we got we got stuff, guys. We got stuff. You can build floor tiles outside the second of the second. I don't think I'm gonna be able to go out the back side here. I'm gonna have to go down the front of this, out the front of the building. But where would I go and why would I go there is what we need to figure out right now. Let's go check this balcony in the front. We might be able to get eyes. That gun case was empty. Oh, shit. Yo, we're just stuck in a fucking, like, apartment thing? Okay, so across the road looks clear. Like, straight across. No, it doesn't. It's not clear at all. Guys, what do we do?
Well, we have no zombies in the front of the building. They're, oh. I just don't know where to go. You know what I mean? I'm not knocking on my door, right? You guys really think they'll come up here? But why would they come upstairs? I don't think they'll come upstairs. You guys got me worried that they're gonna come upstairs. We're so overweight. Um, had some stuff we don't need. We're only gonna we're only taking the necessities. Box garbage bags for rain collectors is what I was thinking. Yeah, I just don't have any freaking I don't have a hammer. Alright, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're still so over. <laughs> They're in. They're in. They're in. They're in. They're in. Fuck guys. Oh my god, they're in! Oh my god. Fuck. What do we do? All right, we got to shed weight now. Uh, everything is we need everything. Shit, 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 shit. shit. All right. We only need one can opener. One. Um, oh, we're still overweight. We're still overweight. We're still overweight. All right, we'll just drop this garbage bag that has a shit in it. Um, we'll grab, grab the tuna. We'll grab the matches. Um, ch -ch -ch -ch. the chips, the seeds, and.
shit. What do I do? What do I do? I gotta, I, I gotta jump? How, how do you jump? I... Guys, I can't jump. I can't jump. I can't jump! There is no window in this room. I would have to leave this room and go into another room, but all the zombies are in that in the main part of the house. I was pressing E. That was... They're banging on that door right now. If I open that door, I'm done. If I open that door, I'm done, guys. We're not tired at all. We're just bored. Yeah, we haven't we haven't got tired yet. I got my, my garbage bag of stuff on me still. Maybe, maybe if we just sit here and hide, maybe they just won't come out here. You know what I mean? Fuck. Wait, the door's still...
were doing we were doing so <laughs> We were doing so good. I, I did not expect them to just come upstairs like that. All right, so hold on. I'm just going to reset the game really quick so it stops doing that lag thing. <sighs> it's Carol's turn now. It's Carol's turn now. <laughs> I tried. Oh, hit the railing? Like, physically hit it? I didn't, I didn't know that was a thing, dude. What's up, Mr. Smith? All right, solo, custom, next. All right, Carol, where do you want to go? Run down the stairs straight. Yeah, the, the problem was I didn't know that area at all. So even if I did try to escape, I had no clue where the hell to go. No, no, no. We uh we already played as Darla earlier, and now we're just doing some like special challenges, trying to challenge ourselves. Darla's still alive. Darla's still alive. Yeah, I turned zombie respawn off. It should have been off in that last one. Um, if not, I'll I'll make sure it's off this time. Alright, we can't go to Rosewood though. The only thing is Rosewood, I already know Rosewood. Yeah, so I feel like it wouldn't um I want I want to go at least somewhere I've never been before. Yeah, Rosewood is the place where Darla lives right now. That city. <laughs> he didn't kill any zombies, so response didn't man. <laughs> it was so true. I didn't kill a single zombie. I pushed a couple of them. South Maldra. Okay. Oh. Going South Maldra. Um, we're gonna load up, load up pro player. Make sure zombie respawn is off. Zero. Zero. Rally group size 200. That's not even freaking a thing. All right. So, Yovana got you going to South Maldra. All right, occupation. What do you want, Carol? I mean, you could just tell me what you're like. You know, if you had a job or something that you wanted to be in real life, we'll we'll just go with that.
Yeah, how about we do that? Job in real life. Like, what is your job in real life? Raven is nice. Chef Carol. <laughs> Go with Chef. All right, cool. All right, so we need to give you some negative traits. Um, Giovanna, you want to pick her negative traits? Or Carol, you could just tell us everything bad about you. Uh, right now, Quentin, uh, I don't have anybody specific. I'm just randomly just, just grabbing people. Cause we need negative. We need at least four points. Wow. Chef comes with three cooking right off the bat. One maintenance, one short blade. That's not bad. Oh, that's fine, Carol. Yeah, so Giovanna, uh, just give me some negatives and some positive traits. Guys, Carol's going to survive way longer. We got this. God said she's going to make it too easy. I don't know that that seemed pretty freaking impossible guys like you know what I mean like that was I don't get how anybody could play that cat eyes outdoorsman okay lucky okay Smoker. Well, Carol just said she can't see, right? Is there one that has bad sight? No, I don't see one. Pick short sighted. I didn't see that one. Oh, here it is. Boom. Short sighted, Carol. Pacifist. Okay. We need two more points. Yeah, I tried shifty, I tried E, I tried just sprinting over it. It, it wouldn't happen. All right, we need two more points so we can go with... Uh... Yeah, we're making Carol right now. Get wakeful. All right, so now we need one more four point at least. Yep, 
Yeah, we can do a slow healer again. Slow reader. Alright, yeah, we'll go slow reader. That's a good one. We need two more points. Coward make her death. Oh, my. <sighs> um, underweight, underweight. Okay, Jesus, it's gonna be tough, guys. We're not gonna be able to find enough food. All right, so now um, if we take one more, we can go with stronger. Or stout is, so we need two more points. So one more lower healer. Okay. And we can go with strong. There we go. We got the Carol build. Got you as a chef. You're a slow healer, underweight, pacifist, smoker, short-sighted, and a slow reader due to the fact that you you have a hard time seeing and your cook cat eyes outdoorsman wakeful lucky and strong so let's let's do it We're gonna make you look like Carol from The Walking Dead. Because Carol from The Walking Dead is awesome. All right, so we're going to try to give you as many clothes as possible. No baseball cap, though. I'm going to give you glasses. Um, we're going to make your eyes red because that's awesome. Go with a denim shirt. Oh, that's really good though. Being able to get denim right off the bat. Um, long sleeve tee, pants. We're gonna go with long denim, or uh, we'll just go with jeans. No, Darla's still alive. Uh, we'll go with uh, long socks and we'll stick with the sneaks. All right, Carol. Amaru. All right. Here we go. <clears throat> Yeah, Darla still being alive is the reason why we're doing these challenges because everybody says that Darla's too, game is too easy. Yeah, we got to give people a chance. You know, character creation is that's that's pretty much <laughs> like Bruce said. That's the main part of uh of your guys' life in this playthrough.
Really? No way. I've spawned here before and the freaking I was locked in. Door's fucking locked. over here. I have no clue where I'm going right now. Okay. Um, let's see, let me see, let me see. area is pretty chill. Ah! <laughs> Carol. <laughs> we got you out. We got you out. See a cornfield, which means there might be a farm nearby. We definitely don't have no foraging skills. We got a hammer. The hammer and the scissors are about all we got going for us right now. I think maybe we follow this road down. The only problem is water. Like, we need water and we're going to freeze to death. Right, but I am liking the fact that there's not a whole lot of zombies right now. That is a big ass cornfield. Oh, I see a building. I see a building. Not really seeing any zombies. Carol, I think we beat the game. 
I'm seeing some blood though. We do got a hammer. So if we need to go hammer time. I see a zombie. I see two zombies. I see three zombies. Still don't have any windows. One coming. Oh, there's a well. There's a well. Come on. Come on. Where that? That? That short sighted really sucks. I literally could not see that zombie until it was literally right on top of me. Alright, there's no alarm set. And a well. Oh, we got water. Okay. Okay. Got a garbage bag. I'm in the woods over there. Um, this place might might be worth uh, trying to secure.
Okay. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Bruce, Oz girl, you guys are slaying me. All right, awesome. We got a little bit of food. All right, let's finish clearing this place out. gonna figure if this is uh we'll see if this is gonna be somewhere we actually want to stay right now i think it's our best stop oh and we got water in the back oh this is definitely a good spot yeah we're gonna fight for this place some painkillers um <laughs> jesus <laughs> How many zombies we need? <laughs> Alright, so we don't have to worry about water. We don't have to worry about... Uh, well, the only thing we got to figure out now is food, which we could probably get good on foraging. I know Carol definitely just put work in on... Got a decent amount of warm clothes on, so we can actually go outside. That's um downstairs bathroom. Actually ripped that up. Oh, let's dump this out. Boom. We got our freaking one of the best water bottles in the game right off the bat. Beautiful. Um, I Actually, I don't need this bowl to have water in it. So this is our base. It's going to be our base for now. We got some jarred peaches. So right now, let's uh, clean out the bodies. Because if uh, you stay around the dead bodies for too long, they'll make you sick. these out my path. I don't want to keep walking into them. Do I, I need to get into this uh, figure our way into this warehouse area too. I think we can break break the door down. All right, so we're gonna go do a clear around the base. Um, just kind of see what we're looking at for zombies. Want to walk out? Can we get corn out of these fields? I don't think so. Oh, it's rotten. Okay. 
It's all good. We're going to do some foraging. Um, I wonder if there's zombies in there. I hear somebody banging. I've seen those trees move. So we got water here that we can fish. Um, we can wash our stuff. Efren, thank you so much. Thank you so much. I really, really appreciate that. Guys, let's get some hearts in the chat. Thank you so much. Let's get some hearts in the chat for Dracos, Bruce, Carol, for, and Osgirl for scaring the shit out of me too. Oh, we got a door right there. I seen it. This looks like a gold mine. All right, can you? Efren, Hardened Survivor. Wow, thank you so much. Why? Every time I try to bring my weapon up, it freaking right clicks like that. It's so annoying. Yeah, J Dracos, I was actually having a lot of problems with my sound. For some reason, my sound just was not working, dude. It was so annoying. Oh, okay. So we got we got gardening stuff. Let's actually equip this in a secondary. Start filling up. Yeah, I was having a lot of audio issues. It just wasn't working, dude. It was. I don't know why. It's not set up any different than it usually is. Oh, yeah, that place did. Yeah, that place looked pretty awesome. Where I spawned, there was a lot of zombies there. Come on, give me the goods, because this isn't, this isn't. Oh, we got a flashlight. All right, so this isn't really in, in the gold mine that I thought it was going to be so far. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll mess with a crowbar. Oh, I did not, dude. I did not notice that little star. Our hammer is taking a beat, and we're going to actually have to swap off that. Um, because I need it for work. Empty watering can that will help out with our gardening.
Yeah, I don't know if we can go back there. There's too many zombies. Box of nails. Oh my god. Okay, we got a knife. And a pencil. Alright, well, we got a little bit of a, a little, little bit. A little bit of uh, stuff. Nothing great. So, the one thing that we don't have a lot of is food. Um, that is for sure. Um, food is going to be an issue. We have a hammer. We have a nails. So we can board up our windows. We have water. So yeah, the only thing we need to worry about right now is food. Let me actually throw this garbage bag. The garbage bag contents. Right in here. The only thing we have right now for food is some damn... Uh, Jarred peaches. It's literally the only thing we have to eat. And some chewing gum. So what I'm going to do is we're going to go and grab these seeds. Shit, I can't even plant. It's about to be winter time, right? Yeah, we're feeling it right now. All right, um, let's unequip. Keep that on us for now. Um, shit, that sucks though that I can't plant the damn. All right, let's go out and try to see if we can do some foraging. I've never really done foraging like that. Some zombie stew? Hey, we might have to at this point. Why can't I forge anywhere? Well, you said I won't find any food? Yoza Hutsa. Oh, my God. All right, I got another idea. All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. Um, shit, I need, I need, I just need a forge for s s anything. You can't forge at all. Like not even for materials. Alright, I just need to find a foraging area, guys, so I can, um, I got, I got another idea, but even if I can't forge, yeah, that's all I need is some sticks. Hmm. 
here we go. Materials. Fish. Yep, we're gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna try to do a little bit of fishing with a spear. Got to listen out. I don't need grass. I just need some tree branches. Stick. We can eat the grass, though. That is for sure. We won't be very happy, but it, it's something. We can eat all this. Awesome. We got a tree branch. <laughs> Jesus, Efren. <laughs> Holy shit, man. That is Efren. That is huge. Holy shit. Oh my god, thank you so much. That is, that's crazy huge. I, I really appreciate that, Efren. Yeah, we're gonna have to figure out uh, something. For, well, we got some grass. Um, we're probably gonna eat a little bit of that tonight. And we got some bark. What can I do with this bark? Make tea. Unequip this. All right, I want to grab the spear. Um, put all this extra stuff in here for now. So let's eat, eat some, uh, Oh, you can make a cup. You can make a birch. Yeah, so we're in, we can make twine. Let's eat some grass. Definitely not. Definitely not gonna beat the game eating grass, but it'll keep us alive. that door that and all right and uh we're gonna hit the bed and then in the morning oh did i even clear the upstairs yeah we're good right, let's get some sleep Yosa, thank you so much. Hey, man. Uh, well, because I know I did the NDA. I, I, that was actually one of the things I was going to ask you about if I was allowed to play that or not. On, Because uh, I know you guys, like when I was doing the testing for Undead Labs, I couldn't play it on stream or anything. Um, so that's just something you got to let me know, dude, because I'll be playing. I'll play the shit out of that, dude. <laughs> for sure.
All right, it is freaking snowing outside, man. What do you mean don't go overboard on the grass? I mean, we're severely depressed. Severely. Do I have anything that can... Uh, actually, these jar peaches. Let's eat half. Yoza, again, thank you so much. That That's huge. I really appreciate that. Freaking Efren. Oh, my God. Thank you so much. All right. I think the gum helps with unhappiness, too, right? Yep. All right. Let's go out and try to do some fishing. Have you ever seen cow poop? Don't eat too much grass. <laughs> Fishing. All right, here we go. Catch, catch something, anything. I got faith. I got faith. We're gonna catch something. We gotta catch something, right? Come on, please. Oh, freaking minnow. It's no good. You can't eat faith. <laughs> All right, so we're yeah we're in between that six and nine a.m. right now. Seriously. cold don't want to catch a cold no luck try again later uh, we used a decent amount of our spear condition so we're gonna drop that in here all right um hmm Trying to think of which way we should go. I don't know this area, so we're gonna just kinda go scouting. Do a little scouting run. Pop off our water. We got our peaches, right? I'm 
and check these walkers real quick. See if the zombies had any. Um, I don't think they had any food items or anything on them. Any other warm clothing? The East. <laughs> All right, so we're going to have to, yeah, we're going to have to do some uh, bad guys. I'm scared to head up that way because I know what's up that way. Um, maybe we'll follow the river north. See if we can find anything up that way. Oh, the snow's starting to fall. Look at this. We got enough layers on right now, though. We're not freezing. Snow is starting to build up on the ground. I also have a mod um, called Melt Snow. So you can actually melt snow and um, turn it into water. What do you mean, Andrew? Back to the base and draw the zombies. Oh, go back up to the base and... Dude, that's suicide, though, for me to go up there. Oh, I see a building. I see a building.
Yeah, you can't turn around. Well, I have it set to where if I get uh, infected, I die within a minute. Carol, I'm sorry. Grass fed zombies. <laughs> oh. Grass fed zombies. <laughs> All right, Amara, where do you want to go? Where do you want to go, Amaru? Grass-fed zombies. That's too fuck. That's too funny. Yeah, this this shit is no joke hard. No joke hard. Riverside. Oh, I've never been there either. All right, let's get our uh, pro player going. Let me make sure my zombie. Yeah, see, so if I get no infection mortality, one minute. So it probably was a bite then. Yeah, that got changed. Uh, we'll turn off respawn. That, that's good because I actually have a good burglar build right here let me know if you want me to change um, any of your skills oh we can't even go with that build I forgot I had uh, never mind so I'm gonna uh, let me just next So burglar has a 14 trait uh, deficit that we have to overcome. All right, I see. All right, so negative traits, obese. Organized. Um, out of shape. Smoker. I think out of shape makes it so you can't get uh, unfit. And slow reader. Okay. And then positive traits are fast healer. Start with thick.
Is Rosewood? I've never been to um. Uh, what you would call it? Uh, Riverside or uh. Gun and Junkie, the other one. Best one. Yeah, you're gonna have to add some more negative skills. Yep, yep, yep. All right. Yeah, you're going to need a couple more negatives. Unfit instead of out of shape. Okay. Oh, yeah, we died, can you? We, we totes died, man. It was bad. Asthmatic? Ooh. All right, uh, five more points. I thirst? Oh my God, I'm gonna die. All right. Speed Demon will kill us, but... I'm not, I can't even fight. I can't even fight. Amaro, what are you doing to me? We can't even fight. Let's do it. Super long hair. We gotta give you the red eyes because they look awesome. So you hit him with that monkey cue, Sharingan. And it just, you know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? Then I'm sure we're gonna go long sleeve tea because this will keep you warm. Even though all this stuff's gonna get replaced like instantly. Jonathan, oh my God, dude, thank you so much. I don't know if we got this. This has been pretty rough. All right, here, Jonathan, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I appreciate the faith that you have in Amaro here. Amaro gave me the worst possible traits. We're going to, we can't, I don't even know if we could fight. But the good thing is we can hotwire cars. Here we go, here we go, here we go. I gotta say, insane zombie pop, it's it's pretty insane. No, uh, you know, like it's not one of those things that you like can even like like you can't mess that up. Like there's no 
like failure to interpret what like it like interpret what they're saying like it just it's insane all right we spawn in the trailer park see what it looks like Got a few zeds over there crazy amount back there All right, let's see what we got. Take the painkillers. Yo, the only problem is I don't know what side the river's on. <laughs> Lighter, grab the bowl, throw the bread knife on our belt. All right, so this spawn is already better than Carol's. Carol got shafted super hard with that spawn. Apple cider, no way. Okay. Um, did we go check the trailer south of us? All right, here we go. Trailer burnt down. Get into this one. Hey, yeah, there's only a couple thousand zombies, nothing to worry about. Broccoli seeds. Um well seeing as we can't do any gardening right now. Oh, <gasps> matches old cooking pot cider I don't know which way to go. It seems like there's more buildings that way. And I don't know if we want to go towards more building. The zombies are... truck Mistakes are made, mistakes are made, it's, we're good, we're good.
Uh, we'll head, we'll head, we'll head north. Northwest. Thirsty. Um, drink quarter of this. We got this, don't worry, we're good, we're good. Ah! Yo, you motherfucker! <laughs> Fuck. Oscar! Hey, good night. Thank you so much for hanging out tonight. I really appreciate it. Tomorrow's gonna live. That's on a little bit. What if I go north, Anzer? What if I go north? the zombies were supposed to be urban focused there's more zombies in the woods than there are in my regular game okay right a road right a road right a road um So I just keep, I'll just, I'll just keep heading, no, not that way. Right, so we'll keep going north.
thirsty again already. We'll hold off. I see a house, I see a house. But our, our problem is we really can't even like fight though. Bad to see one right now. at least probably get in here. Zombie in here actually. Now we got water. Oh, never mind, never mind. Let me pour this on the ground. Wasted all that water, though. I can't afford the weight. Oh, I should have emptied it into the... We made, we made mistakes. Dumped all that water on the ground. It is what it is. It can't be undone. All right, so we're full on water. We're good. We have water for now. We get some clothing. off these rags check him did I not wash these oh there you go I can rinse clean all of them
Okay. My bedroom, so I want to make sure that's covered. Let's take inventory. We're gonna. This is gonna be our base of operations. Seems pretty clear right now. Um, get all this stuff here really quick. Then we can just kind of see what we got. Hold on one sec, guys. Winston. He was, uh, had a lot Winston outside. He was assaulting the door behind me. All right. So let's take inventory of what we got. We have our water. Where's our water bottle? Grab our water. Um, we got very, very little food. So let's see. Food, what do we have? Uh, we have the rest of our apple cider. We got some canned cheese sauce. Canned pumpkin, canned tuna, and some peanuts. Mm. Okay, so that little bit of food might last us, like, we probably got, like, maybe a week. And that's starving. I mean, we're going to, like, be, like, before we die, maybe, like, a week. Um, we'll carry a bandage on us just in case we get hurt. Um... Water, I'm not too worried right now. I do want to check this shed outside, so grab a rolling pin.
Cigarettes. Awesome. Okay, so there's not too many zombies. We do gotta get rid of this corpse, though. Yeah, this would be uh yeah, this would be the last one for tonight. Oh, I see the water. Okay. This isn't bad. I'm trying to scout and see if, what the zombie situation is looking like. We have a bunch to the south of us. But I feel like those are ones that we could uh, take care of eventually, like over time. Let's uh, head up to the water because that's going to determine... Um, what the rest of our life's going to look like. Wow. Seems super clear up here. Tomorrow, are you seeing this? This is a good spot. Like I said, we got to work on them zombies. So, you know what? Right now, let's... Uh... Let's do some foraging for some materials. Be nice if I can get multiple tree branches. Oh, we're getting exhausted. I want two tree branches, please. We got chipstone. Want one more, one more tree branch for the win. Now, the reason why I want another tree branch is because I want to build a spear and I want to build a hammer. Oh, that's going to get us nasty cold. Oh, awesome. All right, we can, we can stop for the night. Don't want to get cold and wet. We got all the tree branches we need. Let me uh, get some more rip sheets from this zombie. Alright, so we got water. Um, did I not rip these?
Uh, maybe not the jeans I get because those are denim. But I thought socks you could rip. Yeah, starvation is uh, my number one worry right now. We got a little... Alright, so we're gonna... We'll smoke. Oh, I need my matches. Oh, I have a lighter. I have a lighter. Never mind. And it's half full. Awesome. Let me see. All this stuff. Stop that zombie. Nope. I leave them zombies alone. Shit. Um, that might put us in a situation, guys. That's three zombies. broken into the damn house. Alright, so we're in pain. No infection, though. Let's see if we can go clear out the rest of these zombies. Take a painkiller. Actually, I need a wash. Oh, we'll carry these on us. We're going to have to change out our bandages when they uh, get dirty. There's a lot more zombies than I thought.
All right. Um. The peanuts. Spear. Right, we got a stone like a little stone spear now hopefully hoping that will help us out a little bit um yeah that food that we ate really didn't do shite we're gonna have to start working on them zombies outside Try to get not exhausted. There we go. Um, shit. I don't know what to do, guys. This is it is hard. Let's see. Star. Really just want one at a time. We got one. We can rip up. Uh, I want to check to see arm. Nope. See if we can get another guy, another one. Is that a police officer zombie? Got him. We could really only fight like one zombie at a time right now. It's kind of crazy. This thing is loaded. All right, um, we'll take it. We're not gonna use it right now because that would be suicide. But um, we're gonna take it. No, 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 no. We'll just here for now. All right. Bandages. Station. I wish we had a way to disinfect it. That'd be super nice. We had to get another one. 
Yep. One zombie. <laughs> Taking over the world one zombie at a time. Getting a little cold. All good though. I am going to want to freaking eventually we're going to want to uh, barricade up these windows. What cook the bandages in water? Thing's pretty beat up. We stabbed it so many times. It'll keep us warm though. Oh, we had a laceration on our hand too. Hot water plus. All right, yeah, we're gonna have to look into crafting a campfire kit. What does it take to craft one of those? <laughs> take us. Be a cannibal. Oh, I need to look into that, Dracos. Dude, that's a good mod to throw on the server. Fire. Here we go. Um, we need planks, logs. Where the hell am I going to get logs from? I got uh, like one plank right here. Alright, so food is definitely about to become an issue. Um So uh this shit is tough. I thought I had more sticks than... Oh, there they are. Um... Okay, so I have an axe. Okay, maybe we can get a couple logs with this thing.
four zombies, three or four zombies. Two coming. One shot, one shot. Guys, there's more zombies just coming in. What happened to the snow? <laughs> Let's go catch our breath. No, no, I knew I was going to make noise stopping the trees, but those zombies just didn't exist. Like, they weren't here. And that horde must have moved its way up. Yeah, let's open this. Do the canned pumpkin. Definitely gotta wash this bandage. to go and start working on them guys let's uh eat a quarter of this i don't want him to break my door down Banging coming from.
They never stop. All right, how are we looking? Can I freaking cut this damn tree down? Starting to go through our water a little bit. Yeah, we should rest. All these windows open like this, gotta keep these doors closed. So the crossbow's clutch. The only problem is tomorrow's aim is going to be really, really bad. And I don't have any bolts. Guys, holy shit. Where are they all coming from? Yeah, the zombies can smell you. I don't know if they can smell me specifically, but... Seriously? broke that fast? Shit. Better off making a freaking hammer. And just trying to disassemble shit, I guess. Oh, we need a saw. Yeah, we need a saw. Okay, so the hammer was not a good idea.
Our spear is getting pretty close to being done. Yeah, the spears definitely went so ham. I don't know if it's because I put the uh, chip stone on it. But it's so good. No bueno, guys. It's no bueno. I feel like we've fought a thousand zombies already. Uh, we'll grab these. Clean all these rags. All my rags. Pop out this. Our wounds treated. All right, we're getting a little hungry again, so let's uh, eat another quarter. So that's our only problem, guys, right now is food. Might have to get, uh, and, and now we need to also come up with a way to boil water, but I can't even. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, you were right. The tables I can do. Awesome. I can do the table. Maybe I'll get. I only need two more planks. No, table. Oh, yes. So we got two planks so far. table right here yeah we need bolts we're gonna need bolts if we want to use that we need to go to sleep too though fight those zombies Let's see is there like a closet or something we could sleep in it doesn't have a window yeah
Oh, we got that. We got that good sleep. All right, let's eat another quarter. We're really rationing food right now. All right. Um Get rid of this radio. Yeah, I gotta get rid of the bodies before we. But as long as we're not just hanging out in the front with them, we should be all right. And not get, oh. run out of freaking tables. Oh, I can do the beds. See one plank. One. Oh, thank you. All right, so we got our planks. <clears throat> We're doing pretty good, right? I think we're doing all right. Let's head outside. Try to get these guys one one. All right, tomorrow. Do what you do. I just don't think this beer is gonna last for that many zombies. Our spear finally broke. Let me see if I have another tree branch actually. Use it to craft uh, the hammer. But to make the night the night stick work.
Okay, let me grab these logs. These planks. Alright, we got our campfire kit. I'm gonna set that up on the back side of the house. grab all this scrap wood and that's what we're going to use as fuel for our fire for now got no other use so at least at least the scrap wood came in handy for something you know what i mean another quarter all right so we finally finished off that Let's see what else did we got for food we got a little bit of apple cider left we got <laughs> yeah, we're we're not looking good on the on, on the food side of the house, guys. Had fuel, all the scrap wood. How many zombies have we killed, though? Twenty-five. All right, so we got our fire set up. Um, we're gonna have to go do some more foraging. Ah, uh, is there? I'm gonna I'm gonna get the map. So I just don't know this area. I wonder if there's anywhere close by where we can go and maybe do some looting. We're not going to go right tonight. I'm going to be. But, um. I just want to. So we're in where? Riverside, right? Okay, yep, I found where we are. Holy shit, we're way up there. Okay, so there's some buildings to the east. We could just follow the coast. Yo, we're so far away from the city, though. Yeah, this is this is going to be rough. We're super far away from the city. Like really far away, guys. Oh, well, actually there's a little What is this place? Oh, it's a factory. That's right to the southeast and that right where that trailer park I stepped in, right to the east of that trailer park, there is a um a factory. And a diner and a gas station and a storage.
I don't know. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to figure some out though, cause we need food. And just with the sheer amount of zombies, I don't know even where I can go. So I think what we're gonna do um next time is There literally is another farmhouse. There's one right to our south. Or right to the east. That I want to check out. Yeah, I just I, I want to go places super close that way I can just get food And right to the east there's a nice little block of Farmhouses there's like A couple two sheds a small farmhouse there another house there I don't know we're gonna have to see Yes, Amaro you survived one of the hardest difficulties so far I've ever played. Um, now all your only problem is uh, hunger. So thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out tonight. I hope you guys enjoy this. I know we've been streaming for quite a bit of time. But um, I do appreciate you guys for coming and watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, hopefully tomorrow I can get my... PC screwed away so I could be back to my normal stream setup or whatever. But um yeah. Thank you, thank you for everything, guys. And uh yeah, I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Happy Easter. I'm gonna give my kids some stuff in the morning. And uh I'll catch you guys later. Peace.